Welcome to the world of Group Home Riches, where you can achieve financial freedom while making a positive impact on society. Are you tired of working long hours for someone else? Do you dream of being your own boss and creating a better future for yourself and others? Look no further. With Group Home Riches, you can invest in real estate and provide a valuable service by offering safe and comfortable homes for individuals in need. The number one investment in real estate. And start building a better future for yourself and those around you. Let's make a difference together with Group Home Riches. Let's go over the first steps, Andy. Yeah. So we had a bunch of people ask, all right, you know, how do I get started? I have no money. I kind of gave you guys the pitch that you can use to an investor like Chad, but you want to be able to confidently say that. So we talked about Jasmine and how she was living in a shelter and she was able to partner with a landlord. The reason that investor was so pumped about working with her is because she was doing that networking ahead of time. She had the relationships with the nonprofits. She had the demand already. And that investor knew that she was going to be able to fill that property and manage it. And he was going to make way more money than he would on his own. And he was going to have to do less work. With and less so, headache. Yep, exactly. Right. And I think they're up to like four or five properties together. Last time I checked in with Jasmine. So when we talk about nonprofits, social service organizations, for someone, let's say this is the first time they're tuning in, Andy, why don't we break that down? What are we talking about when we talk about referral sources, nonprofits, and places like that? Yeah, this is really the most, in my opinion, Brandon, you can correct me, but in my opinion, this is the single most important thing that you can do. Um, so if you listen to Chad earlier on, he was talking about how he was collecting fees meaning rents, deposits, what have you, before he even opened up his first group home. The only way you're going to be able to start collecting fees and revenue before you've opened up is if you are good at marketing. The best way to get good at marketing is to put a list together of all of the social service organizations in your specific city and county and start reaching out to those people. I'm so going to do this live for those for yeah. folks out there. Awesome. So what we have our, our virtual assistants do, one of the very first things that we do for our done for you clients is compile a list of places like that. And on average, we're going to get between one to 2000 contacts like that, that we can market to for those in our school group. Guys, if you're not in the school group, you're definitely going to want to join. Tomorrow, me and Andy are going to talk about, talk about how we find really affordable, talented virtual assistants that handle all the day-to-day -day activities. That's a whole other call. But I'm going to give you guys a glimpse of what our virtual assistants do for our done-for-you clients. So this is literally the very first actionable step that you're going to take is to just find those those nonprofits and places like that. So I'm in the gold course. You go to your beginner's guide. Again, first step, you guys want to get your get your questions answered. Whatever number one question you have holding you back, drop it in the chat. We'll do our best to answer that. If not, just email us. Email us constantly until until you get that fear and that fuzziness kind of taken away. That's the first step. But the first actionable step is literally just building your marketing list. And we have a whole bunch of uh, guides and, and material in here that are going to help you do that. But I will do it for you guys here live. So first person that's in a metropolitan area, drop your city and I'm going to find a place for you to call tomorrow and you can get started or today. I saw Philly first. Philly <laughs> we got a first. bunch of them coming in. Houston, yeah. Philly, Atlanta. Beautiful. So Massachusetts, actually, Virginia, Richmond. This is great. It's still early. You guys, you guys can do this today, right after the call. Okay. So even if you don't have the gold course, which you should. Every single one of you guys that's putting up your cities, um, pay attention to what Brandon's about to do here in a couple of minutes. It's actually really, really, really simple. And of course, you know, we we do this if you guys sign up for the done for you. Um, but you guys can do this stuff on your own. Your the whole goal is to build up your list in your specific city or your specific county 
of all of the social workers in that area. So, but guys, we have, so we have a keyword guide. It gives you all like the search terms that you're going to, you're going to want to use, right? So Philadelphia was first. You're going to go to Google or DuckDuckGo is the search engine I use. We're going to do one of the keywords, rapid rehousing, Philadelphia. Let's see. I can usually tell by like the name, all of these places you're going to want to put on your marketing list. And this is one of the programs that you're going to want to develop a relationship with. All right. So they get 12 months of rental assistance through this program. They have a stabilization coach. You guys got to really think through that. 12 months. They're going to pay rent for 12 months. You don't have to worry about getting paid. You don't have to worry about your client losing their job. You don't have to worry about your client uh, defaulting on you. You don't have to worry about your client like moving from Philadelphia to Massachusetts. You don't have to worry about any of those things because this organization, what's it called? The Episcopal Community Service Organization is going to pay the rent for 12 months. Now, what again, you guys can do this today. The day is still early. <laughs> but this is what we have our 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 team does this for our done for you clients all day long. So, um uh, Medell is our virtual assistant trained to do this. So what Medell is going to do, is she's going to use that keyword guide She's going to go through all of these organizations. This is confirmed that this is a place that you want to develop a relationship with. She is going to hammer this place. She's going to call. She's going to email until we have a Zoom meeting set up for you. And on that Zoom meeting, you'll have one of our coaches, which is either Eric, um, Terrence, or Jade. We've done podcasts with all of them, so you can hear their stories. They're going to literally pitch you to a place like that. So you'll be on a Zoom meeting. Eric will be doing the call. Hey, my name's Eric. I'm the head of the community outreach team. We're a new real estate company. Rather than go the traditional route of being a landlord, we'd like to offer affordable housing to those who are in need. We see that you have a blah, blah, blah program. <laughs> so you look up what that program is. We see you have a rapid rehousing program. We're just calling to get more information on that. Andy, what do you think the response is when we're actually speaking with a stabilization? Coach? They absolutely love it the same way that me as a landlord would love it if you approached me. Why? Because there is a huge supply demand mismatch. There's nobody else out there doing this. They don't get phone calls like this. So that's one of the things that we're going to do in our, in our done for you program. Mm -hmm. We'll compile that list. You know, we're going to, we're going to do this a thousand times what you just saw me do live for the first person in Philadelphia. And you can see just on that one, that one keyword, you're going to want to be speaking with all of these places that popped up, by the way, every one of these you do, you do your research on it. You're going to have to, you know, this is the name of the game. Okay. Once you guys get over that fear and you're ready to take action, you'll see me talk in school all the time and say, hey, you need to smile and dial. OK, so whoever said Philadelphia, this is what you can do today. Right now, you can call this place. Contact. And you go to the gold course. Guys, we give you, you listen to the actual live marketing calls of our team, our team, me and Andy doing calls like this. But do you remember whoever, whoever was in Philadelphia, you, you can do this right now. Here's their phone number. You give them a call. Hey, my name's Brandon. I'm going to be investing in real estate this year. I plan on opening three to five homes rather than go the traditional route. I'd like to offer affordable housing. You know, I see that there's a massive need for that in Philadelphia. I see that you have a program called, you know, RWA. 
ready, willing, and able. And I'm just calling to get more information on that. And you can hear the calls. You hear the live calls. I'm telling you, you'll hear things like, you've made my day. You know, I'm so glad you called. Because guys, there's people in these organizations, their job is to go out and try to find landlords and pitch them on this. And I'm telling you, they are not as good as us. <laughs> so they're literally waiting for you to call them. Okay. So I did one. I've shown you multiple examples in Philadelphia. Again, you guys can see that that wasn't planned. You can do this right now in your city and do that exact pitch. And you can, here he is. Here's Anthony Moore. He's the, he's the case manager. That's who you want to speak with. So there we go. Whoever's in Philadelphia, I just found your first marketing contact. It's Anthony Moore. Call them today. <laughs> 